Hi, good morning. First of all, I wanted to say congratulations to everyone who's here today. Uh, welcome to UIC. My name is Sonia Gupta, and I'm currently a UIC senior, double majoring in biology and Russian. And today I'm going to be talking to you a little bit more about the Math and Science Learning Center, also known as the MSLC. So if you want to follow me here, uh, the Math and Science Learning Center is a 9,000 square foot space that really emphasizes collaborative learning. And the way that it does this is by supporting students through having spaces where small groups can come and study together, as well as offering tutoring services. The Math and Science Learning Center was recently renovated in 2018 to really support and create spaces that support innovative and collaborative learning. The Math and Science Learning Center supports a myriad of different subjects, including math, chemistry, biology, physics, earth and environmental sciences, and statistics. Currently, the Math and Science Learning Center has 110 students supporting the center through tutoring, logistics, and managing the center. In addition, last semester, we had 230 teaching assistants and 30 professors provide their office hours to the Math and Science Learning Center. The goal of the Math and Science Learning Center is to really support collaborative learning. And the way that we see this happening is through these amazing spaces on campus and the tutoring options available as well for the Math and Science Learning Center. Actually, in the last year, we had around 5,000 students use, utilize the Math and Science Learning Center space. And we found that students who use the Math and Science Learning Center space performed better in their classes than students who didn't. The Math and Science Learning Center is a completely free resource to utilize, and it's open to students from any academic level. Furthermore, the Math and Science Learning Center does not require any appointments, and it's a great place to come and just study if, when you're outside of class or if you want to get support on certain assignments or certain topics. So space is also available to utilize for special events. Oftentimes, professors and student orgs will have events in the space as well, such as professor meet and greets and review sessions. So we're gonna walk over here real quick and see this check-in area. We have a self-service check-in area right here. And after students check in, a student assistant will help direct them to the area in the Math and Science Learning Center dedicated to this topic that they want assistance in today. In addition, the Math and Science Learning Center really aims on supporting collaborative learning. For example, we have a dry erase board walls as well as technology available in space as well. So what we're gonna do, we're actually gonna walk over here to one of my favorite areas in the Math and Science Learning Center. So over here, you can see another aspect of the center where we have a lot of space for individualized study as well as certain areas on the side for small group study. This area really likes to incorporate dry erase walls and also incorporates natural light. So Sonia, one question I had that I wanted to follow up with. You said that your major is biological sciences and Russian. That seems like a very interesting, unusual, unexpected combination to take something in the sciences, combine it with that humanities. I wonder if you could talk about how, why you selected that and, and uh, yeah, talk a little bit more about that major selection. Oh yeah, absolutely. So it is a little bit of an interesting major selection. Um, the reason why I chose both of those majors is because I absolutely love STEM approach and the analytical approach of sciences, but I also really love the humanities. And I think through UIC's general distribution requirements, I really got to explore different fields in the humanities and UIC really makes it accessible to students if they want to pursue multiple degrees or explore different subject areas as well as the sciences to do so. Do you think that helps if you're thinking about a pre-health educational goal to have that kind of uh, area of study in both of those different areas? Oh, absolutely. I think it's really important, especially when it comes to pre-health, to, <clears throat> to have a larger um, understanding of the world around you, not just through the sciences, but also through humanities as well. And so you're gonna deny this, but you are one of our highest, most accomplished credentialed students on campus. You guys are lucky enough to have her here with you this morning. Uh, what has led to that success? How has UIC been able to support the success that you've had? Well, you're way too sweet. I am definitely not the most credential student on campus. Um, but I think one of the things that really helped me get to this stage in my UIC career is all the support that UIC offers. UIC offers support through the Math and Science Learning Center, through professors, um, through office hours. There's just a myriad of resources to utilize at UIC and not enough time to use them all. So, and speaking of all that myriad uh, amount of resources, uh, we're gonna, we got a chance to see the MSLC, but Ashley, our host, is gonna tell us a little bit more about some of the other resources. 
Great. Thank you so much, Casey. Um, yeah. So one of the great things I would say about UIC in general is that um, we do a really good job of making sure that students, no matter um, what, what you're looking to get um, tutoring in or what resources you're looking to find, um, we really break it down um, in a positive way and a way that's easy for you to find um, what you're looking for. So I included on this slide a quick QR co code so you can take a picture of it um, and get directed to our tutoring resource um, space. And one of the things that I think is awesome is that this um, resource allows you to look at tutoring by individual courses, allows you to look in general for biology, chemistry tutoring, um, writing center hours, um, to really give you a, a positive look at how you can improve in your classes. I would say one of the biggest differences between high school and college is the fact that most of our students at UIC who want to be successful will um, seek out tutoring before they think that they need it. Um, and I think that Sonia and all of our students would echo that as well, um, that tutoring is really for all students. Um, the coursework at UIC is really challenging um, and it's challenging um, in a good way because we want to prepare you for whatever's next, whether that is a pre-health ed goal, whether that's something in corporate, something totally different, um, something you haven't even thought of yet um, as a first year transfer student. Um, so I would definitely encourage you to look at some of our resources um, outside of just the Math and Science Learning Center because I think that um, you will really see there's lots of different ways to get support as a student at UIC.